Android tablet. Right. So on here it's an application. It's not a browser. You can use any browser you want and we're filtering. Okay. So I just that shows you the application. When it's finished, we'll have uh, a link here that'll take you to the web admin console where you can configure and see reports and do all that kind of stuff. For right now, it's an application that all happens locally. Okay. So really, the only magic that I can show you is the fact that I'll try to go somewhere objectionable. Oh, okay. And, and it will block. Okay. Let's hope. Let's check it out. All right. So I'll launch a browser. Let's use this Dolphin browser. And so we don't use a blacklist or a whitelist. We actually filter dynamically on the device. So I don't have a list of bad URLs that are blocked and a list of good URLs that are allowed. We actually, our engine analyzes the content on the page and makes a call and categorizes. Oh, okay. So we could use any site as an example. An easy one is playboy.com, but um, just so you know, it's not because it's in some kind of list. It will actually look at the content on that page and, and categorize it, and then depending on the settings I have, block or allow that page. So I'll go ahead and try that one. Play, Playboy.com. And hopefully, it says no. Oh, net nanny. So that's the block page. Blocks. Right? So this is skin for the whole user. That's the category, right? So if I look at the details of it, it'll tell me what the URL was. Okay. Uh, so it actually, the Playboy.com knew that we were on a mobile device. You know how websites know that? So it actually, that's the URL. It's not just Playboy.com, it's Playboy.mobi. So it actually knew who we were, but we intercepted that traffic, uh, parsed the page, categorized it, and put it down as pornography and blocked it. So that's happening as an app on the Android device. So on the back end, you would be able to log into your administration console, and you can see, I don't want to install my new Android operating system. Um, on the back end, you'd be able to log in, you can change the settings, I can loosen them, I can tighten them, I can create exceptions, uh, all that kind of stuff. And in addition to that, we're building this out as a security suite so that you can uh, not only do the block and allow on web traffic, but you'll be able to uh, do a GPS locate of the phone. You'll be able to remotely lock or wipe the phone and even do a backup or a restore to that phone. You'll be able to see all of the text messages that are sent or received on the phone and oh, wow. receive alerts if the content is objectionable. Uh, on the business version, we'll have anti uh, virus, we'll have anti malware uh, software on there, and a mobile firewall, uh, all kinds of stuff. So it's more of a security productivity suite for businesses. It's a peace of mind, uh, keep your kids safe suite for home users.